What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Call of Duty Modern Warfare. And there's been some leaked news going around the last few days kind of revealing what they're going to do with the new system since we're not going to have a traditional prestige system in Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Now of course this has been leaked by the Gaming Revolution who is usually pretty much on point with all of his leaks. Now not everything is always 100% but this is usually a pretty good source for leaks. So I'm going to link this article from Charlie Intel down in the description below if you guys would like to read over it for yourself. But the leak is now they're going to do the prestiges a bit different. How this is going to work is there's going to be a set uh, of base levels and season levels. Players have the base levels which they stay consistent throughout the lifespan of the game. There is a, uh, there is a 55 base level. Once the user hits 55, there is no prestige in Call of Duty Modern Warfare. The system will reportedly implement seasonal ranking for the Call of Duty Modern Warfare uh, game, where each season will bring new ranks and the ranks will reset at the end of the season. Once you reach the base level of 55, which is the highest base, base level, each season will bring new temporary levels that will reset every season. So pretty much whenever you start off and you're grinding through your levels, you hit 55, you will be 55 and you will hit a, a, a temporary rank for that current season. It says like there's going to be a, a kind of guess. Now, of course, we're not sure exactly how many levels are going to be in each season. But it the, the kind of speculation is you can go from 55 to a max level cap of 160. So once you have hit level 55 and you're in a, a, a certain season, you have the ability to go all the way to level 160. Like I said, this has not been confirmed by Infinity Ward or Activision or anything like this, but it does seem like this could be the way that this, the game is kind of going. And now each season, so once you know one season is done, that level 160 will reset back to 55 and you will start over for the next season. Now each season will give uh, out some emblems so you can kind of sport that emblem for whatever season you know that you're wanting to represent. You can kind of you know sport that rank emblem for those seasons. So it kind of does give you the same kind of feel of prestige emblems, but it's going to be season emblems instead. Now, I do feel like this is a, a, a different spin on it, a kind of neat idea, but a lot of players, I think, are going to feel like the grind won't be there. I, I, that's the one thing. Uh, every COD that I have ever played, I've always tried to hit max prestige. Now, of course, in like Black Ops 3, Black Ops 4, uh, Call, of Duty Modern War, uh, Call of Duty World War 2, excuse me, you know, they raise the level cap to like a thousand. Once you hit max prestige, you know, you got to go from max prestige to level a thousand. Now, I did not always get to a level a thousand. I did get up in the 700s in some of those games, but it's kind of the thing to grind for. So I know a lot of people out there are kind of curious what will be the grind once you have reached level 55. Uh, of course, some of the other things they're going to kind of implement in the game that's, of course, all speculation right now is the amount of ranks or, or levels you can level up your weapon. The Rumored level right now is level 80. That's going to be a, a lot of ranks for a, a particular weapon, and I'm not quite sure what they're going to do for 80 ranks. I don't expect them to make you wait until level 80 on each weapon to unlock all the attachments. I'm not sure exactly what they're going to do with that unless they just give out some different rewards kind of past a certain point. You know, you unlock all the attachments at, let's just say, for example, by level 40. And then 40 to 80, you're going to unlock camos or something like that for those weapons they're not really been a lot of detail on that just yet and like i said all of this is leaked so take it with a grain of salt but also know that this could be the way that the game is looking to go i, I find this interesting i guess because the whole idea of the grind I, I guess people can grind out certain weapons but at the same time a lot of people may feel like there's not a lot of grind within the game it's going to depend on how long the seasons last and going from 55 to 160 in each season Will probably be a grind in itself that's pretty much going to be like going through a prestige or two so you will get emblems within these seasons hopefully they will find a, a way to implement some very very cool emblems within you know these rank ups that way it will feel like that you're kind of going for something and also hopefully they will find a way to give out certain rewards from 55 to 160. that way it always feels like you're gaining something while doing this and it doesn't just feel like well i've hit 55 now i'm pretty much max level in the game until so and so season comes out so I'm looking for some changes within this that you know we don't really know about yet, some details we hadn't heard about. And like I said, this could be completely different, but this does seem to be pretty legitimate. Uh, we haven't heard anything from Infinity Ward yet. The only thing we heard from Infinity Ward, of course, was a while back 
and they said there would not be a prestige or a traditional prestige system. There would be something new within the game. And now that we're getting close to launch, there's been a lot of leaks coming out. And I, I was going to make this video a few days back, but I kind of wanted to wait and see if anything had changed with this leak. But it still stands pretty strong that this is the way the game is going. I'm kind of curious, what do you guys think? Do you want that traditional prestige system, that, pre, uh, that kind of traditional grind? Or do you like this new idea with you know, prestiging or ranking up within each season and also ranking your guns up to really high levels compared to past Call of Duty titles? I find that it's going to be something new, so it may be fun for a while. Whether it will stand the test of time like the prestige system did, of course, we'll have to wait and see when the game comes out. But like I said, guys, leave me a comment and let me know your thoughts. And of course, if you like the video, make sure you hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And make sure you click that bell icon up in the top right corner so you know when all my videos go live. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.